Part of the day in my life is I woke up at half past seven. I woke up early enough that I did washing, packed the dishwasher, and I made oatmeal cake. Okay. Okay, full transparency, I just had the most stressful time figuring out technology my heart now part of a day in the life of a va or an aspiring va when i am doing some va work is creating content so i put this on so i could take a picture stuff like that and looking at content online and being inspired seeing how i could use what i'm seeing either elevate something or make something my own. There's so much out there, but you gotta kind of figure out how you can give back if you want to put out content. It's not a philosophy, it's just really something that I think a lot of people who want to be creators need to understand. If you're not providing value in some way, shape or form, it's very hard to keep up and it's very hard to gain traction. And I've definitely noticed that. I'm still growing, but at the same time, it's a lot of that figuring out how I can best actually bring value to followers or potential followers. That is like content creation. I went through a lot of different ideas. When I have like a creative idea, I'm like, oh, I want to do this, but it can never really come out the way I wanted to, or it feels like it's copying someone else. So I did a really simple design that hopefully catches someone's eye. After I create this, this type of content and use different elements and the biggest element for me and I pay most attention to is the font because I know that if there's cool fonts it catches my eye so I want to see how that works with my potential followers so far it's been good so I'm kind of trying to roll with that and then really get graphics and they have the whole package but again it's such a process and I'd like to have you come along with me during this process now after i've created this image obviously i have to post it and like you have to figure out the time in which to post that's one thing but at the same time you can post anytime traction will just come if you're using the correct hashtags if you're like interacting if you're posting your story all of those things are very important it really just depends on who your audience is and who you would like your audience to be and really focusing on your insights not necessarily the numbers and the people who the amount of people but noticing oh you get people at this time are interacting with content or it could even be the people that you're following seeing when they post and there's a lot to figure out i know i do a lot in my head and part of me is like write it down get it down so then you have like a game plan which is very important strategy. After you post, you usually see if people interact with it, whether it's on your stories or whether it's commenting on things. It could be maybe the day later, depending on where some of your followers are. So I live in South Africa and some of my followers are in America or Indonesia or somewhere like that. Then it's about being aware that you're not gonna get certain followers engaging with you on that day, but they might engage with you in the middle of the night or the next day and not to let that deter you from posting but just to be aware of that and if that's not the way you want to operate you might have to just really tweak certain things you never know but again i wouldn't stress this enough it is a learning process and you kind of need to go with the flow and if you can figure out a good strategy for yourself believe me if you enjoy what you're posting you'll figure out your your strategy that will best help you now for the rest of my day i have gym it's gonna be so nice monday through friday i go to gym i train bodybuilding style a lot of it at the moment is about like stamina and endurance because of the world it's been really fun and for me i've seen a lot of results i would bring the camera with me but uh this is my gym outfit now let me see it it's black and gray even my shoes my legs are so so i can't lift them that's pretty much it when i get home i'm probably gonna do some editing some 
posting, engaging. I'm just about to post an Instagram story. Yeah. I don't know, this has been quite productive, even though it's a weird type of productivity. It really feeds into that creative part of me, which sometimes I like suppress it to like get things done. I'm really enjoying the space and balancing that with university and all of those other things. This is a nice change of pace. That's a little bit more about here. I hope to bring you along on that journey of figuring all those things out, how to balance and just how to like really feed into my creativity as well as that analytical part of my mind. <laughs> So the last part of my day is posting. Now I have posted that piece of content that I made and now it's about likes it or comments or whatever. But again, it might happen tomorrow. So I'm just gonna go through a couple of stories, try and interact with other people's content, do the thing. Okay, it is 10 to 10 so i'm a bit tired so my energy is like way down thank you so much for joining me for my first video and if i got it all to work together don't forget to leave a comment down below about any topics that you want me to discuss really anything i'm open to ideas please like and subscribe i'll see you soon